good everyone i hope you guys have an amazing day so what i'm going to do today i will explain to you guys um, a functionality that's been introduced as a part of winter uh, 23 uh, that is to call invocable uh, methods in apex class right um, so you might have used invocable um, method in flows or invocable apex in flows um, like for instance right i got this um uh, uh the simple invocable um like a date invocable so it will accept the date and the number of days so and it will return you uh, the date past plus the number of days so for instance uh if you're passing today then if you pass the number of days plus three it will give you um today's day plus three right pretty simple okay so sounds pretty good uh and then uh, you know, you normally use this things in flow, right? But that being said, you know, they've introduced a new feature uh, using which you can use uh, the invocable Apex, uh, sorry, this specific um, invocable in Apex. Now you must be wondering, hey, I could directly use it, right? Like date invocable. <clears throat> well, uh, I'll show you a better way how to do it. So what I'll do, first I'll show you the uh Flow how it looks like. So this is a pretty simple Apex action, right? It takes the current date, adds three, and in advanced field, I manually signed a date value. Pretty simple, right? So if I debug it, um, so as you can see, it takes uh, you know current date because it's not it's set in the US time, presume. It's not in New Zealand time because it's 27th, as you can see from my on my laptop. Um, it's 27th. Uh, it shows 23, so it might be United States time or Canadian time, whatever. Um, so, um, yeah, I've added the three, and I got the output 29, which is correct. Okay. Now, how are you gonna? So, if you wanted to say, if you have a business case, or if you have a use case, right, where you wanted to use this uh, invocable. Uh, method in your apex code um, so how do you do that so it's pretty pretty simple um, so this is something um, it's a it's a new feature it's a new addition uh, as a part of into 23 um, so you call invocable dot action so this is something you do it and then um, you can do a standard uh, action or you can do the custom action in this case we are dealing with the custom action so what type is it? Is an apex and the name of the the class, and then the params. What you're gonna pass? The, it has to match the input. So in this case, it should match these two names, right? Um, and and yeah, and then um, you can um, use this uh, invoke method to get the result, and you see if the result is successful. Then you get output. Let's run it, right, and see what happens. So I'm passing today's date, which is obviously going to be um, uh, the 26 according to this laptop, because I haven't configured the time zone to be New Zealand. So that's presume the reason. This is just a trial work. Okay, so I just execute it. Um, okay, so that's correct, right? You got the output. So that's a pretty simple and nice feature, I would say. You know, it's very cleaner in terms of uh, implementation, right? So you just, you know, pass the invocable invocation uh, params, and then, yeah, we'll take care of it. So, yeah, I hope you enjoyed this uh, tiny uh, episode. Um, so, yeah, there are a lot of exciting things that's happening in the Salesforce space, especially as a part of the winter uh, 23. Um, I'm going to talk about it more. Uh, just one announcement to make. Uh, I'll be starting a new series on Health Cloud. Uh, yeah, Salesforce Health Cloud. So, Health Cloud is a pretty uh, interesting cloud, or interesting tech, I would say. Um, I use Health Cloud because I work for, um, you know, I do work for Ministry of Health in New Zealand. So, HNZ, Health New Zealand. Uh, they rebranded the name. So, you know, I can't call Ministry of Health. So, Health New Zealand. So I do uh, stuff for them. So we do use Health Cloud. Um, so yeah, it's interesting, right? I mean, a lot of things you can do in respect to a, you know, 
provider or a pay payer. Um, you know, I'll talk about it in details when I start the series. So, and I do appreciate the fact that you know um, there are a lot of uh, clouds out there, and you guys are requesting me to do different certs. Yeah, I'm gonna I'm gonna get there, right? Um, you know, I because I've been getting a lot of requests around uh, health cloud lately. So yeah, I might as well. I thought I might as well do it. It's it's gonna be a tiny one, maybe 20, 20 episode like I did for Net Zero, right? Um, and yeah, so uh, that's all I wanted to. Um, I wanted to I wanted to talk today. Hey, and by the way, if you like this video, if you think uh, someone else gonna be, uh, you know, getting benefit out of this video, please share uh, with who you wanted to share. Right? Uh, I will totally appreciate it. So that being said, I hope you guys have an amazing uh, Thursday. Adios.